Uh, today I'm going to show you how to do this look here, which is just like a wavy look um, using this, I believe this is two inch barrel, it's either two inch or one and a half inch. And um, I don't even know what brand it is because it was, I've had it forever and it was a gift. So, um, do your VO5 spray to protect your hair, which I've already done. You're going to want to make sure you brush out everything. And so you take about a one inch size and you're going to take, make sure you're curling away from your face. And you go like this and you just pull it through and spin it around. And you're going to want to stop while you're doing it to let it heat up the part up on top. So you're going to slide it through keep curling it. And then as I twirl it through like this, I hold it through each section. So you pull it down and just twirl it. And then you're going to let it sit there while it's heating up. Go ahead and spray it with some hairspray. I'm using Bedhead because it smells really, really good. It doesn't smell like nasty hairspray or anything. So you're going to uh, still want to hold it for a while. Make sure it's getting nice and hot so it will hold that curl. Yeah. Okay, ready guys? And then you take it out. You should have something like that. It's a little messed up right there. Just pull that down. So it's curled. And then um, the front is most important. So this is the last two pieces here. So this is going to go. Make sure you give it a nice little brush away from your face. Slide it down, curl it. Make sure you hold it and let the top part get heated. And then, um, so you just put your thumb on here and when you want to move it you just open it up a little bit and then slide it down and recurl. So just slide it down and recurl. So you just let it give it some looseness and then curl it up. And then when you have all the hair there, just make sure that you have enough time to get it nice and hot. And spray it with some of your hair spray. Mmm, yummy. Okay. Depends how hot uh, your curler can get and how your hair is for how long you want to hold it. So you get a nice little curl. I'll spray that then. And then now we're going to do the last piece. And this is the front piece. You're going to want to make sure you don't get the other curl in there. Like it just did. You want to brush it away from your face. It's going to be away. Shake your curler. Make sure you keep the curler moving. Then when you have it all wrapped up in there, you're going to want to spray it, of course. And just let it work its magic. Let it stay in there. But this is like a really simple kind of wave look. Um, it's going to fall out a lot and not look so structured. And it'll just look like a really pretty wave going on. Let it in. You should have that. Um, I kind of didn't move it fast enough, so there's a little bit of crease. But what you want to make sure is you go like this. When you put it on, you immediately start turning it so you don't get a crease. And I can't believe I got a crease on the front. So that's 
it. Just do one last spray. And this is what you have. Um, really nice. It'll definitely fall out later so it'll look more like light tousled curls or waves rather. So it's pretty simple. If you have any questions, let me know. And oh, also, um, if you're interested in a tutorial on the makeup look I have on, just go right here, and that'll take you to it. So if you have any questions, guys, as always, let me know, and I'll see you later. Bye. Well, let me give you a closer look of the curls really quick before we leave. Okay, guys. Have a good night. Bye.